Hey guys, in this video, we're going to take a look at how you can install Windows 10 from a USB boot up disk for your HP Compact DC 7800 computer and see how well it can run. So this computer is quite old, it's called 2 Joule, uh, around 14 years old now. So let's uh, find out if it still can run Windows 10 and run uh, quite efficiently. So first I'm going to um, restart the computer and press on the F9 key so that I can boot up from my USB drive. I'm going to restart the computer again. Okay, and press on F1 and then F9. Okay, USB device. The Windows 10 logo appears on the screen. Okay, now choose your language and click on the next button. Then click on install now. Okay, on this screen here, I'm going to choose install Windows only. And I'm going to choose that partition there and then click on next. And now it's copying files to the computer. Okay, now we're going to need to set up the region. So I'm going to Leave it as the default and click on yes. So I'm going to click on skip on the keyboard layout. Now this computer has only two gigs of RAM, and it has two. Uh, it's a core to core two two, so it, is, it has a, a CPU of two gigahertz. Okay, so we're now up to adding the account. So I'm just going to choose offline account. And it says sign in, you enjoy. So I'm just going to choose limited experience for now. You can always uh, sign in later on. And here, it says who's going to use this computer. I'm just going to say admin. Click on next. And just going to create some temp password. And click on next and then you need to um, create the security questions so I'm going to choose uh, one of the questions here and then you can just answer something random or in your case uh, just answer something that is relevant to the question okay so now it has finally uh, installed let's see how well we can use uh, Windows 10 on the HP Compact running a core to Joule. So here I'm going to open up Microsoft Edge and try to browse the internet. So let's see if we can try to download something, perhaps another browser. Chrome. So it works fine. You can uh, browse a website. Let's see how fast is the installation of an app. So here we're going to click on the download button. So I'm just going to accept and install Chrome on Windows. Okay, here so I'm just going to try to change the the soft icon on the home screen. So if I click on Sims. And then if I go down and change the theme, or well I can um, set icons. So I'm going to choose desktop icons. Okay, so there you have it. Uh, Windows 10 on a uh, HP Compact old computer. Everything's still um, running okay. It, it is a little bit lag, but overall it's not that bad. You can use it to browse the internet. So uh, I've got eBay here, you can open eBay, 
you can do shopping online online shoppings you can use Microsoft Office if you got one installed at the moment there isn't uh, one you need to sign in so that it can uh, download so there's other things you can do um, like using the calculator calendar you got calendar here alarm clocks and yeah other things so basically Spotify so you've got Spotify here as well so you can use it to listen to music so it's not bad you still can use this old computer with uh, Windows uh, 10 so if I go into properties you can see the properties of this computer it's a desktop um, 2.33 gigahertz of CPU 2 gig of RAM and this is a 32 bit uh, system and that's it thank you for watching this video Please subscribe to my channel for more videos.